going on guys welcome back to the channel so today I'm going to share with you on how I paint a tombstone there are plenty of tutorials already on the web I was kind of hesitant even to put this out there because there's already so many options out there but I've actually never seen anyone do it the way that I um, paint the tombstone um, obviously usually you'll either paint it gray and um, whitewash it with black or paint it black and whitewash it with gray and some whites and tone it down um, I do a different process here I simply just take a sponge I think I'm using a car mitt here but the underside is like a sponge um, you could pick up a, like a one of those little squeezy sponges the dollar two dollars from Walmart and simply just dip it in the paint put the black down well first you're gonna paint the entire tombstone gray and then next step is to paint it all um, smother it with black paint doesn't matter how goopy it is just get it on there spread it all out and then next step is to put the gray paint on there and once you're putting the gray paint on there you simply just keep blending it in until you get the final result here and it's extremely simple I never came across any video of anyone painting it this way um, before so like I said I, I really wasn't gonna put this out there but since I've never came across it before and it's an extremely simple process it may be beneficial to some people who are you know on a time crunch and just want to get this done and once we get the paint blended in the next step would be for me to get the wording on here normally I would have carved out the words on here um, with a Dremel um, but unfortunately I really just don't have time to be doing all of that it's, it's extremely time consuming so this year we are going to be using vinyl as the lettering and what we'll do is um, we'll cut it out with a silhouette um, you could use a silhouette or Cricut it's vinyl lettering um, you get the outdoor type that's used like on boats and stuff so that it really sticks and it's it's good against water and rain and simply just apply it to your tombstone um, and you can and the best thing about that is you could pick fonts right so you could get like a chiller font or it's you know some Halloween spooky font and just print it out and simply just stick it on so that will be the next step after this